Okay, welcome back. Uh, today, Sang Lai went to the markets for me and picked up all these fruit and vegetables. Um, I've been toying with an idea that um, as Sang Lai is very good at picking vegetables and she does get a, a little bit of a discount being a local. I've been toying with the idea of doing a Sang Lai grocery shop. So you pay a pick fee, say $1.50. Sang Lai goes to the markets for you and gets you vegetables and fruit. Uh, it's much easier if she has a few people because she can make a bulk order and just do one shop and it's a lot more lucrative for her. Um, we do pay for this in the West. Um, U Foods uh, is big in Australia, same kind of thing. They go and pick vegetables for you and you make different meals. This here can be done every second or third day. Um, today, the, um, the avocados were the most expensive thing for Sanglo to buy. Uh, everything else was, this is, makes up for nearly over half the price. So all this here cost uh, $3.50 for Sang Lai to buy, uh, plus I pay another $1.50 uh, for a picking fee. So that all that, that cost me $5. Uh, the avocados were very expensive. If I would have bought uh, to buy these in the supermarket, the avocados are $4.50 a kilo, the tomatoes, for some unknown reason, were very expensive at $5.80 a kilo. The carrots, $1.50 a kilo. The pineapple would be $0.80. Cents, um, and the bananas were $2.50 a kilo. I uh, kind of worked out the weights of each of the items. So what's on the table there would have cost me around two. Uh, sorry, $7.60. Um, so I paid Sang Lai $5, so I made $2.60 without going to the supermarket. I saved a lot of packaging as well, uh, plus that $1.50 goes to Sang Lai and not to the big supermarket. Uh, tomorrow I'll be doing a walk and talk for the COVID-19. Uh, the story has been changing very quickly. There's a lot of new developments. Um, so I didn't, every time I was about to do the um, walk and talk, it would change. So this has um, really thrown a spanner in the works. When I, every time I try to do it, it does change quite a bit. Uh, but tomorrow I will do a walk and talk. Until um, then, uh, see you in the next one. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe also. Plus, down below will be all the links to all the different YouTubers that we do listen to and talk to. Uh, as well as um, we did do a live stream with uh, Dave for his 1,000th. And also there was Andy from Going Nomad, a.k.a. Pigs on Vikes. That's a very funny, well, we thought it was a very funny um, live stream. If you want to watch that, it's um, down below also. Thank you. And, yep, see you in the next one.